Hi guys, welcome back. I hope you're all well and having a good day. Now before I start this video, I just got a really exciting parcel from the postman. My friend Jeanette in Australia, I asked her to send me this to do some reviews at some Australian candy. But that's going to be in a future video. So if you want to see it, subscribe down below and you'll see everything. So today's video, I'm going to talk to you about some of my favourite Scottish words. In Scotland, we have so many words that are different. And if you're over here visiting, you might not catch the gist of a conversation or know what people are on about because the words just completely are not like English at all. So my first word is shugal. Now the word shugal means shaky or to shake. So in a sentence you would use it as um, that's a bit shugly if you were talking about something that was a bit shaky, obviously. Um, or if you're putting your key in the door and it gets stuck, you would give it a shugle to get it out. Or you would maybe, if you had your baby in our pram and it wasn't sleeping, you would just shugle it gently and hopefully the baby would fall asleep. My second word is scoosh. Now scoosh means to squirt or to splash. And I would use it probably, um, so okay, you've got your can of condensed cream, which I think you would call squirty cream. So in Scotland, we call it squishy cream. So if you're having an ice cream sundae, you'd put a bit of squishy cream on the top. Or if you're in your car and your windscreen's dirty, you might use your squishies and squish your window to clean it. Now, number three is one of my favourites and I use all the time. The word is muckle and it means either huge or big or just enormous. So, I mean, you can use it for anything. Um, an example would be if your friend lives in a big house, you would say, oh my God, your house is muckle. It's a muckle big house. Um, but yeah, so it basically just means big or huge. Now, my next word is actually two words, but they both have the same meaning. So the words are jobby and tolly, and they both mean poo. So for the word jobby, that would be one I would use more often, and I would probably use it if I had the dog out and she had a jobby and I had to lift it. The word tolly, I think is a more offensive, if you're more offended by the poo, so when I was thinking of an example for this, the example I came up with is if you go into a public toilet, you open the door, you're bursting on the loo and you look in and oh my God, there is a muckle tolly. So you're more offended by it. So you would say tolly. The last word that I use all the time and you'll hear all the way through this channel is we. Not we in the you and I me and you we sense but in Scotland we also means tiny or little so you'd have a wee cup of tea or you know a wee cake with your wee cup of tea so yeah we means little so if I was to put all the words I've just told you into one sentence it would go something like this we Johnny went for a jobby but nothing came out so he gave it a sugar and out with a squirt popped a muckle huge tolly that looked like a curly whirly. So I hope you've enjoyed today's video of some Scottish words. If you have, give me a thumbs up, give me a subscribe. Also, let me know, what's your favourite Scottish word? What's your favourite word in general? Okay, have a good day, bye.